new crisis for Georgia emergency rooms. Local hospitals plagued by hours long wait times. It comes as COVID-19 cases surge here in Georgia. We saw 2300 new cases over the weekend. That's compared to just 300 during a two day time span last month. CBS 46's Crystal Bowie is live at Emory Midtown explaining how more infections and a staffing shortage. Well, Crystal, they are leaving hospitals stretched thin. They are incredibly stretched thin. Now behind me, this is actually one of the hospitals that is overloaded with patients. The wait times are getting longer and we've learned inside many of the departments are just saturated with patients. Juliet hopes as she was stuck waiting at the Wellstar Kennestone Hospital's emergency department in Marietta with a couple dozen other patients. It just took forever. There were people sleeping on the floor. When I asked how much longer it would take for me to be seen, what I was told was the issue wasn't the room, the issue was the nursing shortage. She said it took more than 10 hours before she was seen. It was alarming. But Kennestone Hospital isn't the only place in the state that has patients sitting tight. This database by the Georgia Coordinating Center shows at least 18 hospital emergency departments in the last week have been coded in red. They're marked as severely overcrowded. Some of those places even had to divert patients to other nearby hospitals. It's just only, only going to get worse. We have another like Delta variant, I think, out. It's just tragic. Right now, Georgia is seeing potential for another wave of the coronavirus. Nearly 30 to 40 percent of hospitals statewide are seeing a rise in cases and hospitalizations. What we're hearing is when the patients do come in, they're sicker, requiring more resources. Added to that, the president of the Georgia Nurses Association says some hospitals are attributing the wait times to a staffing shortage. You know, there's openings in just about every emergency room in the state of Georgia. Emory University Hospital Midtown's latest status said three departments were saturated. A spokesperson attributed some of it to a higher number of COVID-19 patients coming in. The university released a statement saying in part, quote, patients are also presenting with a higher degree of illness, which requires more resources to provide care, leading to longer stays in the emergency departments and more patients are requiring admission to our hospitals, which are also busy. And I reached out to Kennestone Hospital in Marietta to ask for a comment after hearing from the patient who told us she was waiting there for 10 hours. They declined comment tonight. This is just a reminder if you don't need to be in the emergency room to make sure you instead go to urgent care. Reporting live in Atlanta, Crystal Bowie, CBS 46 News.